Five middle school students are recovering after police say another student gave them prescription drugs at school. It allegedly happened this afternoon at Starbuck Middle School in Racine. Rebecca Clough here in studio with what the school is now saying about this. Rebecca. School is launching an investigation, but Racine police did take a student into custody. It's now quiet at Starbuck Middle School, but that was not the case earlier today when five students had to be rushed to the hospital. Racine police say they had taken prescription medication given to them by a classmate. Amy Ditloff has two children in the district, one about to start middle school. She says that's not something she would expect. I just think it's very sad, just a horrible to have that in such a young age. Police say the student brought in the prescription medication from home. Paula O'Brien Salstead is a grandparent in the district. She says when her own daughter was that age, O'Brien Salstead could not even send her to school with a Tylenol. I remember um, when the kids were, when my kids were in like middle school, even to take an aspirin or even to take uh, allergy medicine or anything, they had to go to the office and have it administered with a nurse. And they did, they did locker checks and things like that. Kirk Christensen says he put seven kids through the Racine School District. He says the blame doesn't belong on the school. It really all starts at the parent level, and uh, that's where it starts, and that's where it has to end. The Racine School District says the students who took the medication are okay. Police say the student who gave them the medication was a 14-year-old boy. The district says appropriate action will be taken after their investigation into this situation is done. All right, Rebecca, thank you. And